Asa, I just wanted to give you a message from Bo. He's held up at work, but he wants you to know that he will be here later, he promises. Okay. When that son of mine walks in that door, I'm going to be the first man to shake his hand. He finally bagged that maniac, Mitch Lawrence. Hey, Grandpa, I'm really sorry, but something's come up. I, I have to go. I've got a real surprise for all you people. I, I know. I, I'm sorry. I'll come back if I can. Max, I didn't know you were going to be here. Hey, oh, oh, I'm not with Asa and his crowd. I'm here with Roxy and the kids. Oh, oh, I see. They're still having fun together, are they? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think Marcy makes Al smile more than anybody else I've ever seen. Yes. That's just true. I agree. <clears throat> it's just I wish that... Oh, don't say it. You're right. Honesty is certainly not the best policy always. Is there something up with Bo? Uh, yeah. Well, mm -hmm. no. I, I was honest about my feelings about Bo and Nora, their relationship. Mm. Oh, you mean about being jealous? Yeah. Mm. I, 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 I don't think it was a good idea that I said something, but on the other hand, if I didn't say anything, I think my head was going to explode. Hmm. Well, that must have been why you were having cocktails last night with Troy MacGyver. I would blow off a little steam. So, what's the story on you and Troy Boy Toy? I, I'm not going to go talk to the kids. 